One. Okay, one thing that most people don't know about me is that I've wanted to be an astronaut since I was three years old. That's when I first told my mom that I wanted to be an astronaut. Uh, when I went off to preschool, I told her I was going to school to learn to be an astronaut. And when I was in uh, kindergarten, I wrote my first uh, very poorly written book on going to space on the Soyuz vehicle. When I was in sixth grade, I had a birthday party and I asked every single one of my friends for a calculator uh, for my birthday. And I didn't tell my parents because I was too embarrassed, but uh, I got a lot of calculators and I was super nerdy about it. Uh, but one of the things that I learned was, uh, you know, you just got to be yourself. Uh, I wanted a bunch of calculators. I got a bunch of calculators and that was okay. I was a huge nerd then and I'm still a total nerd now, but uh, hey, nerds get to go to space. Three. Another thing most people don't know about me is that I played rugby. Well, maybe if you're close to me, you probably know that because uh, I'm a little bit uh, crazy about rugby. And the last time that I played was about a week before I got selected here at NASA. I played in the English Premiership in England and then I went back and I played on the US national team. One of the things that I learned about uh, myself playing rugby that I apply every single day is when you think that you have given everything and you have nothing left to give physically and mentally, you have a reserve that you can dip into and you can just keep going. Four. I was a helicopter pilot in the Army. I flew helicopters for about 10 years before I became a test pilot. And uh, one of the things that I learned flying helicopters is that when something looks really risky from the outside, that people that are doing it on the inside, uh, they're not professional risk takers, but they're probably professional risk mitigators. Bye. One summer, I watched the movie Top Gun so many times, probably three times a day for a matter of months, uh, that my brother finally took the tape out of the VHS and broke it over his leg so I could never watch it again. I was absolutely devastated, and so maybe it's partly his fault that I have to go uh, live that dream as a military pilot. Um, but uh, you know, you never know where you're gonna get inspiration from. And if you're inspired, well, then just keep doing it. Even if your brother says not to.